This is your AFN Misawa News Break. The F-16 Fighting Falcon has only one engine. The airmen that maintain and repair the jet's engines are crucial to ensure the safety of the pilot and mission. You know, they come in here, you know, we get teared down all the way, and then we order all the parts, and then wait for the parts to come in. When they do come in, we start building it up from square one. The 35th Fighter Wing Propulsion Flight is a central repair facility that maintains 150 engines, including the ones in Korea. Most of the time, it's usually a, uh, a time change or a, uh, an engine upgrade when they, before they come here, but we also do get some motors that come in with something that's not as in-depth. Because the engine is such a crucial part of the plane, during its time in the propulsion flight, the engine goes through a numerous amount of inspections. At Tessel, they do all the checks, and then it comes back to us, which we do our final inspection. Once we say it's good, quality assurance comes over, we get the stamp of approval, and then it'll be ready. Even with all that work and only five to eight maintainers working on an engine at a time, more often than not, it takes no longer than 17 days to have an engine completely up and running. It's a lot that goes on to tearing down and rebuilding up one of these engines. And then if everything goes good in Tessel, then, you know, we, we meet our goal and it goes out of the door on time. The job can get stressful at times, but airmen like Caldwell and Barnes find satisfaction in the end result. All the time and work that goes into it to see it actually run successfully and you know that you had a part in that. It's awesome feeling, you know. Just hearing the engines start up or take off, I mean that means that we do good work. The flight has a large stockpile of completely functional spare engines to ensure jets never go a full day without one. Staff Sergeant Candace Harris, Misawa Air Base, Japan. <laughs>